Hi and welcome to my tower renovation video in Enshrouded. My name's Huckster. Okay, well I was uh, on a mission to get to a particular area which is here. We're here at the moment. Um, so I'll come out a bit. Basically the old capital city which is up here. Now this is all black at the time and I've been all around here and that's cliffs and this is valley of death filled with shroud and then, and then eventually after near, numerous attempts I managed to find my way through and this is all really hostile and way above my level and pretty scary so I desperately wanted to find a place to put down my flame which would allow me to have a camp which will allow me to port backwards and forwards, so I'm going to have to go through it all again. So I found a tower. And this is what it looked like before. Oh, what's that? What's further north? Alright, I think I will... I'm tempted to actually turn this into my own. I wonder if I can. Let's have a look. Um, v. Flame altar. Uh, we'll go there. Ooh. Well, this could be quite cool. Yeah, why not? <laughs> All right. It's mine. <laughs> I can come back here now anytime. That's good. Right, what do I want? I want a workbench. I'll pop a workbench over there in that corner. Okay, so I had to clear out all the rubble and replace a lot of the walls. It was beautiful. Don't get me wrong. The developer, whoever designed the original tower had done a fantastic job it looked spectacular but uh, you know I just wanted to practice renovating and building up and modifying yeah and I, I, I'm gonna be honest uh, I'd never do it again renovating was way harder than actually start building from scratch so right so here I will put some gates if I can get hold of some there's no actual access from the ground floor at the moment there's a massive pile of rubble here and i had to i probably had to replace about i'd say 40 to 50 percent of the walls uh because you know they, they were full of rubble so it, 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 they couldn't be uh, used so down here i've uh, i put my pad so i've got to have somewhere to sleep so this is my bedroom and dining room, kitchen, the usual, you know. Um, building down or underground is so much easier <laughs> than building high above. Okay, so this is the only access to the second floor. And then we'll come out here. I'll put in all the stairwells, there's no stairs or anything. So this is basically the, uh, the second floor. Uh, these, it's just practice. I have every intention of building a proper castle or fortress at some point. Ideally something that the Norman kings would be proud of. And then down there is a scavenger camp. Just You can just about see it, that orange right in the centre. So I've been, uh, I've been farming a few of them, just practicing melee. Okay, so I have to put these in. So it does get very tight, so mind your head. Alright. <laughs> Let me actually do that. That's better. Okay. Right, so we've got another hook point. That wooden floor was in. It was all like this, basically. So I just had to strip that out. Okay. 
that's the only access to that so uh yeah i still i left a bit of the rubble because i thought it was quite cool quite fun but some of it was just in piles and it was just massive holes in the walls and stuff so like it's really tight around here and uh for anyone who's curious yes i fell countless times hundreds of times but i only died i think it's three or four i can't remember so okay right so all of the last um few i don't know about 20 feet <clears throat> is mine i built up so i just put this here just so that you can have a little look around i've not been anywhere in that direct direction which is like north so there's all new territory and i guess that's blocked off at the moment okay so the only way down is this which can be a bit scary i've got to admit so i don't want to get too close to the camp so yeah they're kind of fun cause some mischief so yeah <laughs> that's it i think i was channeling my inner new swan stone now I'll try that in German, but please don't be offended because it's going to sound horrible. Nia Schwanstein. Okay, so I put in a quick access because running up and down those stairs was just doing my head in. Okay, so for anyone who's not familiar with that, that's uh, the, the clue is Disney. Okay, so really this one, I just wanted to say a big thank you to the devs for producing such a magnificent game uh, and I thought about it while I was uh, renovating this castle what an incredible job they've done on everything so just starting at the beginning the concept you know I can create a, car a character bring him here build explore kill fight just it's incredible I can bring my second character do the same thing I can start a new world with this character i can join friends or friends can join me it's truly mind-blowing the scope and then to explore this world it's just beautiful look at it incredible you know it's really quite scary and stressful in fact if you've watched any of my videos you'll see how stressed i do get and it can be really infuriating and frustrating but when you actually achieve what you're trying to do and you get back and you can just go oh i've got a new piece of material i can build something you can spend hours just tinkering away building something i don't know unique personal and so on that the building is just mind-blowing brilliant yeah a hundred percent absolutely so yes thank you very much for this truly epic game so uh, now that i've done by fanboy gush i was just wondering if i could ask a tiny favor if any of the devs are watching i'm not you know not expecting them to but if they do at some point i really need a keg for my bar so like a nine gallon gallon barrel it needs to be on its side and like a block and some bottles so yeah if that is in the making or it's uh, down the line at some point i will thank you in advance so with that being said i spent over seven thousand hours on the last game i played over the years and uh, this one has certainly got my attention so i will be doing lots in the future so if you're interested in anything i do you know consider liking and possibly subscribing but most importantly thank you very much for watching <laughs>